गुड मॉर्निंग फ्रेंड्स हम डॉक्टर योगेश सरोदे ऑफ जीवन विकास महाविद्यालय देवग्राम आई वेलकम यू ऑल इन दिस सेशन टुडे वी विल लर्न चेंज द नरेशन ऑफ क्वेश्चन टाइप्स इन द लास्ट वीडियो वी हैव सीन हाउ टू चेंज द नरेशन ऑफ फर्स्ट टाइप दैट इज डिक्लेरेटिव सेंटेंस we know there are four types of sentences number 1 declarative or simple sentence number 2 questions or interrogative sentence number 3 imperative sentence and number 4 exclamatory sentence so today we will focus on change the narration of interrogative sentence friends we all know that questions are of two types number 1 auxiliary type and number 2 wh type questions now which are auxiliary type questions that is very simple when we ask question by auxiliary verb we get the answer of it in yes or no format simple test if you get answer in yes or no format first then that is of auxiliary type questions so these are the questions in which the first word is a helping verb like is am are was were have has had shall will do does did can may must could should might dare etc you can use any one of these verbs of auxiliary type see the questions are you tired do you sing a song have you taken tea yes did he go there no can you give me rupees 100 note yes may i come in yes like this so all these questions started with helping verb so these are called auxiliary type questions now uh, there are wh type questions so those questions which begins with the first word wh these are called wh type questions so when we use the word what where when why who whose whom which and how so the questions that becomes from these words these are called wh type questions so questions are of two types auxiliary type and wh questions here you will find that there are eight words of wh type eight words and one word is of hw type how so remember this eight wh type words and one hw words see the questions why is he crying or why is she crying you will get reason where will you stay or what do you do with your nose like this so how to change auxiliary type of questions into indirect speech that we'll see first means we have to change we have to change the narration of auxiliary type questions see the example mother said to the girl how you written the letter this is direct question now when we go to make it indirect as per rules inverted comma the removed and in place of inverted comma the reporting verb 
if it is in past tense then the reporting then the verb in reporting speech also changes in that tense and the commas are removed and in place of comma we use the conjunction word if or whether and then the reporting speech becomes plain it does not remain questions for example how you written the letter it will become assertive type for example you have written the letter that becomes plain once you make it you have written the letter then you will change the subject and verb also as per reporting verb see the rules said or said to it changed to asked or inquired in place of reporting verb said or said to we use generally asked or inquired because this is a question then inverted commas are removed and if or whether is inserted number 3 the places of the helping verb and noun or pronoun are interchanged number 4 the verb within inverted commas should agree with the verb outside that is reporting verb number 5 the question mark is removed because now the plain uh, sentence will become plain simple and last is words denoting nearness of time and position are also changed now see again the example he said to me comma into inverted comma are you watching the plants are you watering the plants this is the direct sentence now see how it becomes indirect in place of said to we put asked or inquired he asked me now in place of comma into inverted comma as in earlier case we used that here we will use if or whether also so he asked me if now this you pronoun will change because that is in second person so you will change as per listener here listener is me me is first person pronoun so you have to make the corresponding pronoun of you while making indirect always remember that uh, subject is always in nominative case you know there are three types of cases nominative case accusative case and possessive case i will read the note below subject is always in nominative case jala marathit manto prathama karta ha nemi prathamet asto object karma is always in accusative case dvitiyat asto prathama द्वितीय आणि थर्ड जी केस आहे दॅट इज पजेसिव्ह केस ओके सो हियर मी इज ॲट द प्लेस ऑफ ऑब्जेक्ट लिसनर हेन्स यू इन साइड द इन्व्हर्टेड कॉमा विल चेंज अकॉर्डिंग टू ऑब्जेक्ट अकॉर्डिंग टू मी अँड हेन्स इन्स्टेड ऑफ मी हियर वील यूज आय इन इन because it is now subject and subject is always in nominative case got the point you in inverted commas change according to listener that is object object is me now we have to put it in a subject place 
सब्जेक्ट इज ऑलवेज नॉमिनेटिव करता हा नेहमी प्रथमेत असतो आणि म्हणून यू जो मी प्रमाणे बदलेल त्याचं इंडायरेक्ट करतानी आय होईल आणि मग रेस्ट ऑफ द सेंटेन्स विल बी कम्प्लेन जस्ट ही यू आसो जस्ट यू हॅव टू सी द टेन्स फॉर्म द टेन्स ऑफ द रिपोर्टिंग वर्ब इज सिंपल पास टेन्स सो यू आर वॉटरिंग बिकम आय वॉज वॉटरिंग सो द सेंटेन्स बिकेम नाव आय ही आस्क मी इफ आय वॉज वॉटरिंग द प्लॅन्ट्स सी द एक्झरसाइजेस हिअर आर रूल्स अँड द रूल्स आर सेम ॲज दॅट ऑफ ऑक्झलरी टाईप एक्सेप्ट इन्व्हर्टेड कॉमर्स आर रिमूव्ह अँड डब्ल्यू एच वर्ड इज यूज इन प्लेस ऑफ इफ ऑर वेदर फॉर डब्ल्यू एच क्वेश्चन्स क्वेश्चन नंबर वन फादर सेट टू सन वेअर हॅज मदर गॉन This example is of WH type. Now we have to make indirect of WH type format. So say to in place of it we will use ask because the reporting verb is in past tense. In place of comma into inverted comma we will use the conjunction word same of WH question. If it is where then we will put where. and then sentence will become plain so where has mother gone will become where mother has gone and then you have to change this tense as per reporting verb reporting verb is in past tense so where mother has gone will become where mother had gone and at the end there will be full stop father said to son where has mother gone father asked son where mother had gone example 2 father said to mother is there any bread in the house father inquired mother if now see this sentence is there any bread in the house will make it first plain there is any bread in the house in place of conjunction word we use the word if and there is any bread in the house became past tense according to said there was any bread now see the word of position or tense changes correspondingly so any bread in place of any bread we do some bread in the house father inquired son if there was some bread in the house example 3 i said to her did you play hockey i ask her if you will change according to her listener listener is her her is third person so uh, according to that it will uh, come c and the tense will be again in past tense i ask her if c because that is in nominative case c her chi prathama c because that become that comes at object uh, that becomes at first uh, subject place if she played hockey mother said to the girl did you break the cup mother asked the girl if if she had broken the cup you you break the cup iska past tense hoga past tense bhi likho yahan pe reporting verb is in simple past tense reporting speech is also in simple past tense did so what rule says if the reporting verb is in past tense and reporting speech is also in past tense then while making indirect 
ए स्पीच वी मेक अ रिपोर्टिंग स्पीच इन पास्ट परफेक्ट टेंस सो डिड यू ब्रेक द कप मीन्स यू ब्रोक द कप सो यू ब्रोक द कप विल बिकम पास्ट परफेक्ट यू हैड अ ब्रोकन द कप ना इंस्टेड ऑफ यू वी विल यूज हियर सी अकॉर्डिंग टू द गर्ल सी इन फर्स्ट केस बिकॉज ऑफ द सब्जेक्ट इज ऑलवेज इन फर्स्ट केस सो इफ सी हैड ब्रोकन द कप सी अगेन एक्सरसाइज थ्री चेंज द नरेशन ऑफ द फॉलोइंग सेंटेंस He said to me, "What are your plans?" He asked me, "What?" Now, the, make the sentence first plain. What are your plans? What your plans are? And then change into past tense. What my plans were? Because your will change according to listener. Listener is me, and then. that will come in place of subject so he asked me what my plans were example 2 mother said when did you take bath amita here though amita is in the last we will put here while making indirect first mother asked amita when now did you take bath means you took bath so again past tense so we must we will make past perfect mother ask amita when you will change according to amita amita is girl so will become see because we are putting in place of subject amita mother ask amita when she had taken bath next example is ravi said parag when will your father return from dubai ravi asked parag when now your father will become parag uh, change according to parag so in in place of parag uh, in place uh, at the place of subject we will take his okay because the case of third person is possessive case ravi asked parag when his father now the tense will become again past will will be replaced and would will be placed when his father would have written from dubai example 4 girl said mother how old is grandfather in direct will become the girl enquired mother or the girl ask mother how old is father or uh, the plain will become how father is old how grandfather is old so because the reporting verb is in past tense said so is will become was how grand grandfather how old grandfather is so how grandfather how old grandfather was so in this way you have to make indirect speech of both pattern that is auxiliary type questions and wh questions listen again carefully there are eight words of wh type and one word of one one word of एच डब्ल्यू टाइप हाउ सो फ्रेंड्स इन दिस वीडियो आई हैव ब्रॉट ऑल एग्जाम्पल्स एंड इलेस्ट्रेशन ऑफ दीज एग्जाम्पल्स सिस्टमेटिकली डेफिनेटली यू वुड हैव क्लियर यूर आइडिया आइडियाज रिगार्डिंग द सब्जेक्ट इन द नेक्स्ट सेशन वी विल सी हाउ टू मेक डायरेक्ट इन टू इनडायरेक्ट ऑफ थर्ड पैटर्न दैट इज एक्सलामेट्री टाइप्स so for today this is sufficient good day